What's good everybody? Welcome back to Endzone A World Apart. Uh, for those of you who are new, I'm Katmandu. In this video we're going to continue on with our playthrough of Endzone A World Apart. Uh, I know it's been a while, it's been a, what, two or three weeks probably, the last time we played Endzone. Um, yeah, obviously I was playing a couple of uh, demos and stuff like that that I was given, uh, and little keys that I was given for new games, so we played that. Uh, I've just come away from a week away, a week holiday. Uh, I've come back not 100% though, I'm a little bit poorly, I've got a little bit of a sore throat and stuff, so I do apologise <coughs> if you hear me like that, clear my throat a little bit, I'll try and do it away from the microphone, but I really need to crack on with some uh, recordings, because obviously as I said I haven't done any for a while, um, so yeah, hopefully you guys are enjoying this little playthrough that we've got going on on Endzone, it's the DLC, the Distant Places, um, if you are enjoying it don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe for me if you haven't already. Uh, both the likes and subscribes really do help the channel out massively guys so if you could show your support man i'd really really appreciate it uh, if you guys would like to get in touch with me in the description down below is all my contact details go check it all out uh, if you guys would like to hit that notification bell as well then you guys will get notified when we upload a video or when we live stream as well here's a very handy little tool indeed and uh, yeah in the last episode i did actually have to have a quick look at the last video on the last episode because i'd completely forgot where we got to um but yeah we just recently researched the uh, balloon station so we can finally take a look at the dlc like the new content um so if we go to build in here i think it's logistics nope not technology oh technology yeah so there we go so we can build the balloon station now <clears throat> the balloon station can be used to send expeditions to far away places. Also, with each completed expedition, it gives you the opportunity to take advantage of special trade offers. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, so I'm carrying on building my little area down here for housing. Nothing really else can go up over that way. Uh, I will expand out this way, move everything out that way. So the only real place for it is down here somewhere. I don't want to put it here because I want this for more farming area. Uh, so the only logical place is about here somewhere. Now whether we can put it in or not. Seems quite square so. I think the only best place to put it is there. I guess. Right okay let's do it. I want to put this on as the build next. Hang on a minute. Are we building a... I've got all them built. I'm up. Wait. Uh, well, huh? I'm not building another workshop. I oh, need to up them tools. Um, I didn't think I was building another workshop. And if I was, where? Unless maybe I've got one on on as a like a repair. I don't know. That's weird. Oh, there we go. <clears throat> maybe it was on as a repair. Right, so let's get this built. What does it need? Wood, scrap, cloth, plastic. A little bit of everything, really, which we have got. So that's great. What we like for people. Decent for people. Beautiful. Right, let's speed up time. I want to get this balloon station done in this episode. Uh, we will need to obviously keep a check on the people. Let's make sure everything's good. Uh, food and water is looking pretty. Protective clothing is good. Tools is good. What are we like for? We've got no radiation. Beautiful. We have got a drought coming up. Which is not ideal. Oh, I have notifications. Excellent. Right. <laughs> Let's fill these water tanks up. Let's get these done. Got one here, which is slowly being filled, which is nice. We have the wells, which are within range of that. Okay, that's fine. Uh, yeah, I've got another school down here because we do have a lot of kids. Other schools around here somewhere, isn't it? There he is. Okay, so what we got there? We've got just a productivity one. Maybe we do something else. Badges. Okay, so let's do productivity and badges. Because the badges are quite important when we go on expeditions. Uh, looks like we're going to need a lot of wood. A woodcutter should be up here somewhere, I think. Okay, I'm doing the old cut down and we forest. Okay, that's excellent. 400 more for you. I have a cap, as you notice, obviously, I have a cap on these. Once we hit 100, I want it to stop. These are more important, so I've got these as a 200. 
Uh, we're collecting a little bit more stuff down there. Mainly wood and plastic, really. I don't want this connected to the power source as well, so obviously I'll need to turn that off. I do need to get some more power sources going, though. Let's slow down time. Let's see what we've got for... Okay, we've got one. Do sturdy house. I'm looking for electricity. I want to get the solar collector going. I want to get a lot of electricity going because that's going to bump production up massively. Obviously, we could research that for a trading post. Hmm. Yeah, because that doesn't cost a lot. Let's do a trading post because then we could trade for stuff if we're desperate. So that's not a bad idea. So we'll do that. Speed up time again. Make sure this is getting done pretty quick. Is everything... Have we got people everywhere that we need them? Obviously, so I'm guessing, the, yeah, the balloon, buildings for the scout is a uh, balloon station. So we're going to have to up that to 20 as well. I think we're going to need to start getting some more people soon as well. Graveyard is not that full. Do we need to move the area? Oh, pretty good there for a sec. Get them cleared up. Right, yeah, so people are looking a little... Obviously, we haven't got too many people here now, so I think I want to do... Food and water is real good, so I want to do some more housing. Don't want to do shelters. Obviously, I've got a shelter for the elderly. So that's good enough for me at the moment. I don't think we can squeeze one in here, can we? Oh, we can. Interesting. Okay, I'll put one in there then. <clears throat> we ain't going to be able to put one here. I guess our next best bet is here. I'm going to do a few houses because they will come in handy. Make sure we've got a road going. It's going to have to go round as well, like this. Road already there, so that's fine. Right, how's this getting on? Right, we just need the wood now, okay. Looks like I've got a lot of storage for. Just trying to look at something because we've got a lot of storage in stock. Five thousand. I think we store water here, though, don't we? A load of milk. Hang on a minute. Is there a way somewhere that we can store water? Because I can't remember. I don't think this stores water, does it? I think they store water at houses, maybe? Oh no, that's I think that's the upgraded house, I think. <clears throat> yeah, so that, that stores water, but it's not storing water. Okay, I think I think water will be okay. I don't, like, I'm just sort of just trying to keep an eye on it, because we do have uh, a drought coming up soon and obviously with these extra people I'm just hoping it will be okay yeah the shelter obviously 23 of 25 elderly so everywhere else has just got adults or young adults which is great perfect really they can have children and then move out move on these new houses there we go got all the kids going already beautiful very nice just need a little bit more wood and some more electronics. Okay, so that is within a nice area of this, which is nice. As you can see, we'll probably have to build another one down here somewhere um, for more houses. I'm trying to leave this little bit of space clear for any extra water. Oh, what is this? Um, hang on a minute, let me slow down time. Hey boss, after the hardship of reconstruction, the citizens want you to provide them with a town hall. We can voice our concerns and discuss them there. It would be a great step for us all, all of us, in the direction of a new flourishing civilization. To do this, upgrade the town centre to a town hall. 
Okay, have I not already done that? Town centre. Town hall. Okay, so we need wood. We need a lot of wood. Right, okay, I'm going to do that then. Let's upgrade that because that's what they want. Make people happy. Um, we're going to have to... Have to do something with wood. I'm gonna upgrade. I'm gonna up this to twenty. I'm gonna up this to five. Just wondering if I need to get another wood cutter. Not really a hundred percent where though. Wood super super low, and obviously this is not sufficing just try and think do we get another woodcutter over here maybe you have trees I'm just thinking like here I can't really do a lot and that would be pretty perfect right there to be honest put that next to that do a little road to connect it. Or maybe we can take out <clears throat> probably some of these trees here, to be honest with you. Try and clear this out a little bit for some more expansion. Um, do you know what? I could actually, just while that's being built, I mean, I haven't got a lot of people. This is very interesting. I need to get some more people going. Okay. So what I'm thinking of doing is if I cut that down a little bit, we can go to tasks, gather wood. Yeah, let's just clear that out for now. <clears throat> Need some extra hands on board trying to get some wood going. Excellent. Okay, let's uh, change work area. I like keeping them there, I'm not going to lie. Over here. <clears throat> Get these. Is this that's okay whoa I've just seen a big balloon pop up there we go expedition to the east western expedition expedition to the north southern expedition oh nice right I got it we've got to look at this guys we we'll have to take a look at this <clears throat> right we should be upgrading this yes it's in the process of being upgraded beautiful okay and then our next thing to build is this I'm gonna set a work area just for now No, see, I don't know if I want that. Hang on. I need the whole thing covered, really. Nine. We've got nine up there, so can we get... Even just... Um... <clears throat> hmm... Yeah, I'm gonna put it there for now and we'll put I oh, will have to do that once it's built okay right let's have a look at this so where are we gonna go first what expedition are we gonna do first it looks like we've got to do them to open the next one they're they're locked um so we'll go to the east first why not do I have a connection or has the stupid antenna shifted out of place again whatever <coughs> in case someone out there hears me here are my coordinates. I could use a couple of helping hands. Previous technical experiences. Um, an asset. Okay. So we want metal tools. We need a scrap collector, technical badge, well keeper, and explorer age young, adult, or older. 
Okay, let's try and see what we've got here then. Um, so what do we got here? Okay, so we can send you. We could send you. <clears throat> send you. Alright, so we've got all the badges. Have a look at the age recommendation. And we'll try and have a look for just settlers. Make sure I didn't miss any. There you go, there's one. Nelly. Looking for just settlers. At least I don't have to take them out of a job. Okay, we'll take metal tools. Is it the same we've got none? Okay, and we'll take... Oh no, I want to take a load of them. Alright, so we start to 0%. Okay, so yeah, it's sort of like the Expedition Centre, just on a wider scale, I guess. I don't know if we can really take anyone here. I'll leave that one for now. Task completed, yay! Budding strength. It's made everyone happy. Excellent. <clears throat> Manny, it's time to fulfill one of your settlers' demands. View demands. Let's have a look. Choose one of our, your settlers' demands that you want to fulfill. I can't really do any of them yet because I need to do the prosperity, don't I? I suppose I could nearly. Well, soup or cake, innit, really? The luxury item cake can be produced from conventional food in a kitchen. Settlers and consume cake increase their confidence as a result. The luxury item soap can be produced from milk and healing herbs at medical facilities. I have got a medical facility. That might be the easiest one because I have milk and I've got healing herbs. When used, it increases the confidence and health of your settlers. Right, so we'll do the soap. I can leave it for a bit. I've got four seasons to do that. That's got energy electricity on. Okay, we're just going to hold off. I've literally got two people. I'm going to have to take some builders down. I guess we're not really building at the moment. We are doing that, I guess. Uh, build next. Need to get that wood going. <coughs> right, so we have... Yeah, we do need some more settlers. Being gathered. We need... Uh, let's slow down time a sec. Scrap, scrap, scrap. We're just making all scrap tools. No metal. Okay, can I at least have one on metal then? Yeah, we'll have the one that's got uh, electricity on the metal then. How are we for electricity? We're not... Yeah, we're not overdone. Okay. Alright, that's fine. What is this? Settler's demands. Okay, that's fine. Need to wait for that. Right, let's get this. Let's change this area up. Um, I guess let's just clear out over here. There we go. Get some more notifications. Beautiful. Oh, there we go. We're starting to get some settlers back in now. 50 children. So they should be on their way. I think we're just waiting on the uh, metal tools. So now we're getting that built up. Okay, that's all being worked. Right, okay, let's carry on. What do we like for scrap still? 99. 300, okay. We're going to try and get this done. <clears throat> Cover some more wood from down here. Okay, wood's coming in. Right, 3.1 seasons, okay. Oh, damn. There's a medical facility that's going to fill up now with people. Okay, we're going to have some damaged areas as well now, possibly. <coughs> Where's all my settlers going?
Um, let's pull, let's slow down a bit. I think I'm gonna need some more houses again. Seems like we need way more people. Can't fit that in there. Closest we can go is there. Okay, we'll do that. Build another few houses. We need people. Okay, we'll get them get them built. Ah, now this is done. <coughs> Problem is though, it's people now though. Um Okay, so we'll cut down and reforest. Now we need a better place to cut down and reforest, I think. We need something that's gonna cover the whole circle. That'll do. Quite close as well. Uh probably gonna need a warehouse as well. Over here. So I'd put one here, but I think I can fit another farm in there. Yeah, 16 by 16. I'll get another farm there, so maybe we do a warehouse next, not just next to here. We'll get the houses built first. Uh, oh, the balloon's gone, look. Yeah, expedition is travelling, excellent. So the balloon has gone. Okay, let's speed up time then. Because we've got enough food, we've got enough water to, su to supply some more people, so... Oh no, I was supposed to put one of them things down first, wasn't I? Attractiveness down here now is zero. Alright, let's go to decoration. Scrap totem. Can put that there, that might be alright. A few more trees. Okay, and then once that's done, I'll demolish that. I don't really need that anymore. Once right, so that's gone. We're fluttering on the edge here of people. We desperately need more people. Look, wait, 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 what? Production stopped due to empty work areas. Scrapyard. Forester's Lodge is not. What was that one? Uh, scrapyard, I can understand. Change the area then. Loads of scrap over there. Got any of that's a little bit closer? Okay, we got all this. Beautiful. Grab all that. So this one's probably done as well. Oh no, we've still got 200 and something. Okay, we're getting that from a little bit further. Oh, we've got ruins down here. Two expeditions just down there. That's quite close, actually. Okay. Alright, yeah, so we need people. Water's coming back in. Beautiful. Everyone's now fit and healthy. Let me check. 1.8. Okay, what do we got here? Right, we got one. Let's start the research on the soap. Oh, wow, we've literally got... Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, I need one builder at least. Has anyone been taken off anywhere? Because I feel like a couple of people died. Yeah, we lost a militia. Okay. That's not too bad. <clears throat> yeah, we need we need people, man. Twenty-five people, old people. Let's get these houses built. These children really need to grow up. Seventy-one children. I suppose I need to upgrade this to the advanced school. Maybe hold more people. Probably do we getting that going? I've oh, got five, eight settlers. Okay. Let's go up to four build. I want to try and get these built. Oh wow, we're out of cloth. Hang on a sec. Um, is this not... It's not churning over enough cloth. Okay, so we're going to have to unpause that. Ah, 
have got the refiners already there. Yes, I have. Okay. Right, let's open these up for cloth then. Obviously not producing enough. We've got this open now as well. Uh, strength and metal, glass and concrete. Uh, because we've researched enough now to do the prosperity ones. Which is like concrete making and all that good stuff. Loads of good stuff in there. Beautiful. Doing the soap at the minute. Need to keep an eye on that. I don't want that to go too low. I want it to go as low as possible. Slow down time a little bit. Let's have a look at something. Uh, need hemp. Okay, we wrap. Well, why are we not doing. Huh? Why is that beans? Okay, we need to go back to hemp. If we've got a problem with food, I'll have to get some more food resources going. <coughs> but again, I'm going to need more people. Got this warehouse waiting here as well. Right, all the houses are done. This is being built. Let's get that built next. Nice and quick job. Get a few more builders out. Research is done. Alright, so now let's view demand. Let's do the soap. Soap research, soap produced. Okay, we'll accept it. Okay, so then we'll go to here and we'll make soap. We've got a lot of this anyway, 999. So let's make soap, which is five milk, five herbs. Should have plenty of herbs. Yep, 4,700. And um, I think we've got plenty of milk as well. I'm sure there's a way you can specifically look at what you've got. Ah, oh, okay, so we've got a turnover here. So we're turning over less. Uh, where is milk? You can search for it. Let's search for milk. Okay, so we've got a thousand. Yeah, so that should be fine. Right, so that's telling me we need more water then. More water, more buffalo meat. More squash. Seems like we're using more than we're making. I guess. <clears throat> I don't know, because we've got a lot in stock, so. I know a lot on cloth. I need I know that much. We're nearly there on this expedition is travelling. We're nearly there. Need to keep the people on. Okay, people are growing now, excellent. Covers that area. Oh, just clips that area. Nice. Get a couple more in there. Beautiful. Okay, people are going up. Uh, are we getting this done now, are we? Wooden scrap. Scrap's real good now. Wood's coming in, to, in now. Carbon masks. Okay. A lot of children, which will eventually be turned into obviously adults, so we'll have more of a workforce there. Let's get this warehouse done, sort of ASAP, really. All right, what is this? Production stopped. Oh, I'm guessing it's this one. Change this area. Where are we there? 26 there. They shouldn't mark that for salvaging because I haven't. Okay, now we need to do this. Blueprint for the beacon landmark. Need to get 400 settlers for that. Soap produce. We haven't produced any soap yet. Why? Come on, man. Storage capacity in this building is running low. Get it. Get it out then. Where can we store? Can medicine not get stored? Storage? Oh, oh, oh. Balloons made it. Let's have a look at this. 
Never seen this before. Has someone just landed there? If you did, then press the button at the gate. The intercom only works when you ring the bell. <coughs> so it looks like Lem. You are right, Lem. Um, inspect the gate. Desiree, rotten luck. It's bolted shut, but there are some speakers up there. A bit, a bit improvised, but in good shape. Looks like we'll have to ring the bell. Do it then. Hello. That's too much for me. The bell actually works. Who's there? And much more importantly, do you have the potatoes with you? This, this is the first big visit in years. Nonsense. Decades. I must say, this is. C can you hear me at all? <laughs> yeah, we can hear you, Lem. The connection is bad, boss. Should we keep trying or look around here first? Um, let's have a look at the strange crates. Ooh. Okay, very nice. Um, okay, let's continue on with Hello? the. This damn antenna. I knew that. I'm opening the gate, okay? The roof. You hear me? There's an antenna on the roof. All you have to do. The line's gone dead, boss. He said something about an antenna up there on the roof. It's probably broken. I don't have a clue how we how we can get up there. Um. Okay. Porch roof. Well, that was actually easier than it looked. Sometimes you just have to take a risk. I know, right? To the antenna. Up here is the antenna, and this looks like a fuse box here in the corner. That weird guy said something bro uh, something's broken here. Looks pretty improvised. Okay, let's have a look. Antenna. Fuse box. Give it a try. Perfect. We just need to move it around a bit and the and bend a few wires. Holy taters! You've repaired the system! <laughs> Welcome, my helpful guest. My name is Lem, inventor and third generation builder. I'd welcome you in person, but my mother always said you have to be careful around strangers. At any rate, since you're already here, then do take a look at my technical marvels. Go right ahead. You'll be amazed. Pretty amazed already, mate. You've done pretty well here, Lem. Go on. Just take a closer look at this chip. That's my potato harvester. The only problem is it's not working at the moment. Just so you know, I love potatoes. They can be boiled, roasted, mashed, baked, stuffed, and french fried. Not to mention the chips. A life without this wondrous miracle would be a tragedy. Okay, so we've got... That over there? No need to concern yourself with that. It's just an early prototype. Okay, so you've got a covered machine. A gem, isn't it? Just look at it, and it was all by idea. Strange apparatus or Go broken on. device. Just take a closer look. Sorry, out of luck. One of the tires has gone flat. I'll have to disappoint you. I don't have any potatoes for you. I'm sorry, but my own... Well, I used them up. That's the word. They're all gone. That's how it is. All of this for potatoes? Yes, potatoes! That poor thing actually ought to be working on the fields there. But it's not running. I'm not the youngest anymore, you know. Can you do something about the tire? Um... Just try. The tire. Sure, I already had that idea the day before yesterday too. But then, well, something dropped up in the meantime. Oh, we got and it my mind again. Good thing you're here. Oh, we got some metal tools out of that. We got some plastic. We got some scrap tools. <coughs> one set Ella received a technic uh, technical badge, and we got one knowledge as well. Beautiful. Uh, I want to see what this is. You sit on it and push the pedals, and in the cauldron that makes this. That, um, what's that thing called again? Okay, the hook goes round and round. Great machine. Okay, does it work? Of course. Well, uh, theoretically, I mean. What should I say? It broke down. There were, um, uh, teething problems more than once. Do you think you can get it up and running? I can have a look for you, Len. Oil it. Oil is like magic. All it takes is a little Ooh. bit and suddenly everything works. Now all I need is something to stir. Hmm. I'll see to that later. One more knowledge. We've got some cloth and we got some coal for that. Beautiful. Well, this was this was great idea. That 
heard over that nothing beats a well-functioning machine. Well, soon to be well-functioning. All that's left are a few parts. Then it's ready to go. But that's no concern of yours right now. Just leave it covered up. Why? It's a secret, get me? And it'll stay that way until it's ready. Things unfinished aren't so, my mother always said. It's going to be a masterpiece. No two ways about it. You'd better take a step back or else you'll break something. Um, look below it. Do it. Hey, what did I say? Don't speak. Step back. It's a secret, a very special one. My secret. You didn't touch anything, did you? I certainly hope not. Okay, okay. Okay, fair enough. I know how it is. As a kid, I was always inquisitive. Pa had to hang everything on ropes so that I couldn't get to them. But I got my fingers on most of them anyway. Say, do you feel like helping me? Sure, man. <clears throat> yeah, that's help. I knew that I could count on you. Listen, there's a settlement northeast of here. It was once my hometown. But you've got to watch out. The place is highly contaminated with radiation, and you need special gear. There are some components that I need for perfecting the machine. You've got to get them. We're going to probably need some radiation suits for that, I guess. Large gate. Can I not carry on? I want to carry on. It says 100%. Oh. Wow. How are we going to take all this stuff back? Um... I guess we'll take the metal tools. All the tools are always going to be handy. So is the cloth. There's the coal. Take the plastic. Take the electronic. Can we just take everything, please? Uh, yeah, that's everything. Wow, that was that was definitely worth it. Excellent, right, guys? Unfortunately. That is going to do it for this episode. Um, so hopefully you guys enjoyed it. We've got to take a little look here at the uh, balloon station. Our first little expedition on it, which is great. Um, so yeah, so hopefully, you go, like I said, hopefully you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, smash that like button and subscribe for me if you haven't already. Uh, both the likes and subscribes really do help the channel out massively, guys. So if you could show your support, I would really, really appreciate it. Uh, if you guys would like to get in touch with me, in the description down below is all my contact details. So you can check it all out. Uh, if you guys would like to hit that notification bell as well, then you guys will get notified when we upload a video or when we live stream as well. Very handy little tool indeed. And uh, yeah, until the next time, have a good one. Stay safe out there. Peace out.